Hello and welcome to another episode of the Pen Fan series. In this series, we ask Pen Fans three important pen questions. If you haven't subscribed to our YouTube channel yet, make sure to do that right now. On this episode, we have a very special guest all the way from Turkey. She's living now in Belgium and she will soon move to the Netherlands. So that's really, really great for us. It is Zeynep, AKA write me often on Instagram. And we have three questions for her. So let's start right away. Zeynep, how did you get into fountain pens? Oh, it was years ago. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, uh, I was grow grown up in a house where my father always used pens, not fountain pens particularly, but a lot of drawing pens like the rotring torpedoes and i always like to write travel paint uh, and then in high school a literature teacher of mine uh, gifted me with a very nice small uh, cheap chinese kind of fountain pen and i loved it and then when I graduated uh, university, I got my first Lamy Safari and now I'm here. <laughs> and then and, and you have countless fountain pens. Yeah. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Uh, all right, let's go to the second question. Because you have so many fountain pens right now, how do you store or carry all those fountain pens? Okay, so for me, storing has two different aspects. How do I store them? In my house, I generally use the Galen Leather 40 pen case. Mm -hmm. Nice. This one. And if I'm going out, I have two options. Either I have a three pen case like this one, very used, especially when I was working in the office, three pens, my security card for the elevators and the doors some cash even, and I'm good to go. It's like wallet slash pen holder. And if I'm using a backpack, I always prefer something um, hard case. And this is the Magnum Opus from Galen. Nice, nice, nice. That's a perfect way to, to protect your fountain pens. Um, let's go to the final question. Because Zeynep, what is your top tip for someone using fountain pens? Okay. If you're using fountain pens, it's like using a motorbike. Do not grip too tight. If you grip too tight, your arm will get like, like stone dead. Second, give a lot of maintenance. Clean your pens, leave them clean, not inked and clean them with uh, some clean water. Never use products like vinegar or bleach itself. So the chemicals are not good or never use hot water. <laughs> Always use normal temperature, the room temperature water. And when you, if you wanna have a good handwriting, you need to sit straight like in the motorcycle, you need to look forward like in the motorcycle. If you're uh, slouching over the notebook a lot, and if you are tilting your head a lot, then your handwriting will go down or up or like this. I love that. Those are amazing tips. Yes. <laughs> I see that. I see that. I see that. All right, Zeynep, thank you so much for your tips. Um, again, everybody that's watching it right now and haven't subscribed yet, make sure to do that right now so you won't miss out on a video. And next week, we have another Pen Fan series. So we see you next week. Bye bye.